Yeah, I think the way we're going at the moment, I think where he's batting is 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 right. Um, you know, he batted well in the first test without you know converting it, but um, he's carried that form into this test. You know, we've worked hard with with Ross in the last couple of weeks. We we changed a few little things technically, um, and he's been working his socks off to get it right. And you know, today he just showed what he can do um, when he when his balance is right and everything's working for him. But I think at six, you know, with a role that he's got to play with the ball in our team as well, I think uh, you know to bat him any higher puts him under a lot more pressure, a lot more stress. Um, so he, you know, he does play a big part with with the ball. So not trying to keep him fresh. Um, you know, batted at six today, batted really well. Oh, I think that's a good spot for him. No, you know, you're never happy when you're 113 for five. Um, you know, I think we've Kieran Powell started the day beautifully again. Um, you know, he batted well in the second innings in. Rajkot uh, looked like he was going to carry on from there, but um, you know Shea Hope as well batted batted really well for his 36. But you know those two guys are a lot better than what they're producing here at the moment. Um, you know, and they both know they've left a lot of runs out there. So look, it's it, it comes down to it's not preparation. It comes down to execution under pressure, um, and you know some some decent bowling that you know they they came up against. The wicket was probably at its well is at its best today. Um, wasn't anything in the wicket really, hardly spun, uh, no seam, so uh, very a lot drier than Rajkot. Um, so it was probably at its best for batting today. Um, unfortunately, we just didn't quite grab it by the scruff of the neck. We had you know, decent starts, each batter got off to a, a reasonable start. Um, we just needed one or two of those guys to kick on and get big hundreds. Um, not, not the case, but you know, we, we sat down and spoke. We didn't want to you know, shy away from the hard work. We understand it's tough, um, but we didn't want to shy away from it either. We wanted to stand up and make a, make a statement. Um, we wanted to come back and fight hard. And I, I think, to our credit, you know, we started with Roston, um, Shane Darich and Jason Holder really uh, you know, showed that fight and that quality to, to get us up to a, a reasonable day in the end. Um, would have been nice if we were only four or five down, but um, from the position we were in, we'll take it. Uh, I think he understands spin. Uh, they face a lot of spin back in, back in the Caribbean and domestic cricket. Um, also, he's got long levers. He, he's got long reach. Um, you know, uh, he takes half a stride and he's almost down the, the length of the pitch. So, you know, he uses that to his advantage. Uh, he's a clean striker of the ball. And one thing he does have, he's got he's got fight. He, he loves fighting um, out in the cricket ground. So, look, he uh, he does enjoy playing spin. It's probably his best suit. He's worked hard against the pace, um, and it's not it's not a weakness as such anymore. It, it's it's becoming a strength as well. So. Once you have those both bases covered, uh, coming to India we expected to face a lot of spin and we're going from here to Bangladesh which we only think we're going to face spin over there. So um, it's good that boys are getting a taste for it here uh, as well. Um, the, the, great, the great thing about coming to India, you, know, you have a million net bowlers at most practice sessions. We didn't have any yesterday but um, and majority of those guys are spin. So you know that's that's great, great learning curve for us, and we, we try and get the, the dirtiest, dustiest pitches to, to bat against them, so we do learn how to play spin quicker. You know, he's, he, he's lucky he plays spin naturally well. Um, it's just the fact that you know, he's got long, long reach, uh, he can smother spin, he, he's got good power as well, and you know, plays, plays good cricket shots. No, it's not an injury. Uh, Kemar's fully fit. Uh, it was just, a, just a, the way the selection um, rolled. Um, you know, we would have... You know, we had you know, plenty of robust discussion yesterday about the team, myself, the captain, and the chairman of selectors. Um, and you know, we, we went with the final 11 that we selected on the field today. Um, very handy that we uh, we won the toss and we batted. So um, uh, with with the extra spin option there, I think Warrican can offer us a, a little bit of control as well, um, as well as you know, be a potent uh, you know uh, bowler when the when the wicket starts turning. But it'd be nice, and you, know, um, you know, we still got. You know, Bishu can can score runs. Uh, he can also keep his wicket intact. Um, you know, ideally, you you look at you know the magic number of 400 in the first innings uh, is is something that we we targeted. Um, you know, 350, 400 be be ideal for us at the moment. And then obviously, new ball uh, with Shannon Gabriel with his express pace uh, and Jason Holder back with his bounce and swing. Um, if we can get early breakthroughs, expose the middle order of, of India and you know, put them under pressure with, uh, against the new ball. Um, that, that'd be in an ideal world. Um, unfortunately, we don't live in an ideal world. We've got to work our socks off to get to you know, 350 for a start. Um, 
you know, Warwick Hen comes in too, he, he, he enjoys his batting. So, um, you know, hopefully there are some, there's still plenty of runs out there for us. Roston, if he bats, and his job now is to be not out. If he can get to 130, 140, Marshall the strike, um, you know, Shepard the, op, uh, the, the, the batting at the other end and, um, you know, push on, it'd be, it'd be ideal. Uh, time out of the game, you know, the wicket's going to you know, deteriorate over the next couple of days. Um, and hopefully we've got enough on the board to, uh, to make some early inroads uh, and then cash in when it starts turning.